good morning everyone today we are making raw oatmeal it is something that me and my husband we love to eat a lot every morning if we can um, you can make it any kind of way there's no wrong or right way into making a raw oatmeal you can do it however you want normally we have apples bananas and sometimes we have pears too and we also make a milk with it but we everything is plant-based and nothing is cooked and we use the hemp heart or hemp normally we get it in bulk but they haven't been having it in bulk I don't think but we use hemp seeds and we use water um, and we put it in here in the Nutri Ninja because it's small so it just makes it easier to blend together and we use um, the spring water which is right here I don't know if you can see it but it's the spring water and we also sweeten it. You don't have to sweeten it, but we sweeten it, um, the, hemp, the hemp milk, with uh, just one date. That's all you really need. And also for the raw oatmeal, like I said, we use apples, bananas. Sometimes you can use it with pears if you want. It's what you prefer. And we dress it up with some raisins. We put cinnamon in it and all kinds of stuff. As a matter of fact, I need to get the cinnamon. We use cinnamon also, but I love it. It's, it's quick, it's easy, and it's healthy. And it's to me, it's better than um, cook oatmeal, in my opinion. So that's what I'm starting with now. And I never measure it. I just go with the flow of what I feel like is best. So normally I just put some apples in. I chop up the apples, of course, and just put it in the blender. And unfortunately, we don't have a Vitamix. And Vitamix is a lot easier to use. It's easier on, it's like a better consistency when you are able to use um, um, a Vitamix because there's different types of, I guess, uh, levels or whatever. This is just a regular blender. It's an older blender too. So I'm going to be kind of doing it the bootleg way because I like it. I don't like my oatmeal soupy. Or anything like that. I don't want it like a smoothie. I like mine all chopped up. Now I know I like mine more chunky than my husband. He likes his a little bit more, more uh, smooth. But I like mine super choppy. So you can do whatever way you prefer to do it. But I open this. Hold on. Okay, so I just pour water in it. Some people might have a different method on how they do theirs. They may blend it first and put water in it. And, I mean, put some apples in it first, blend it up, and then put the bananas. But I just do whatever just to get the job done. So... And I, you got to be careful too. Well, apples are not as bad, but with pears, if it's ripe, you got to be careful because they can get real, like a real smooth, like a, a smoothie or something. And what I normally do is get like a something, that almost fell, something like this to kind of blend it up a little bit. Now, mind you, if you have a Vitamix or something like one of those higher end blenders, it'll be so much easier because we've had the difference. It's kind of like you have to blend. I'm going to have to add more stuff to it. It's so much easier. Like you constantly having to make sure it doesn't blend up too much. Kind of like grating it or something like that. I probably put some more bananas in it. And like I said, you can do it however you want. It's kind of best to do it intuitively. 
And some people may do a large serving because then you might have a family. You can do like a large serving. But it's only the two of us here now. So I normally fix it, prepare it separately. I'm, I prepare mine or, and then his. <laughs> One server or two servers? Also, you can use some of the chunks. I didn't think about it. You can use some of the chunks uh, that you cut in the in the actual oatmeal too to kind of dress it up. But see if you could come closer so you can kind of see it. It's like a consistency kind of like oatmeal if you look at it And I like mine real chunky. But some people might prefer it more smooth. But that's one that's enough for that for right now. The next thing that I'm gonna do is make hemp milk. Which is very easy. And you and we have the bullet for that. The neutral bullet. I'm trying to make more room. But you got the hemp hearts. I know we don't measure, I just pour. That's enough. Mm -hmm. Pretty much. I guess it just depends on what you prefer, if you like how you like your milk, honestly. And normally it's one date. And be careful of dates. I remember when I made some raw pie and I didn't think about it when I was making a crust with dates and nuts. And you gotta remember that it has a seed in it. So you don't want it to drink a seed. So I just put it in there. Let me move this out the way. Top on. Like with these, you gotta be careful because sometimes you think you got the tight top on sign and you don't. And then you just have the ninja. Shake it up a little bit and just blend it. Now, 
it's like milk and it's normally sweet too so that's it for that pretty much we're done all you gotta do is just dress it up so normally what i do is just pour it in there good nice good serving Cinnamon on it with some raisins. Uh, I guess I'm gonna put the raisins on first. Just put some raisins. And all the products that we, all the produce that we use is organic. For the most part. I like to just kind of dress it up with some bananas. I, I don't know. I love the bananas in the oatmeal. That one could be cut a little bit better. You know, kind of dress it up a little bit. And I love to put cinnamon on mine, like a lot of it. Ooh, dang it, I dropped it on the floor. Okay, but then. And then the cinnamon. And then you just drizzle it with some cinnamon. You put as much as you want on it. Oh, that's kind of messy, but that kind of, we're going to fix that. But, but that's it, how you make an oatmeal, raw oatmeal with apples, bananas, uh, cinnamon, um, raisins. And then we have our milk. Now, then we have our milk. And you just pour the milk on there and that's it and that's all that i wanted to share with you today something that's simple and easy that you can have in the morning or even if you want to uh to eat it as a snack or something you can too but i like to eat it in the morning something light and easy and that's all have a great day